So we're going to check out this little air compressor um, that comes with a car. Uh, it's basically just to get your home method. Uh, rather than having a spare wheel, you'll put your fluid into the tyre if it goes flat. And the idea is you then use a little mobile compressor, plug it into your cigarette lighter and blow the tyre up. So we'll just check functionality that see if it grafts. ignition on I'll not start the car but obviously if you're gonna blow it up from flat then you better off starting the car to keep the battery charged uh, but we're just going to test function this so what you would do is take the valve out of the um, uh, or, uh, yeah take the the valve out from inside there uh, squirt your liquid in which will then go around the tire and seal the hole oh, yeah. And then you'll put your valve back in and then put this on. And then inflate the tyre. So we can see already it's registering uh, 2 bar there, 30 psi. Which, right. which is about. I need it front 32. So. Right, two. So it goes up in increments of two, so we switch it on. So we're about 32 there. Right, I'll be dead, so that works. So disconnect that. I've got the uh, tire inflator here, we're using the compressor here, so we're just going to see what the reading says on this. And that says 2 bar and more or less 28 psi. Ooh, so it's a couple of psi out, which oh. is probably going to be for what it is. Um, It'll do the job for blowing the tyre up, yeah, but I wouldn't um, recommend you go off the dial. Mm. I would just blow it up for a pressure that you're happy with until you get to a garage and blow it up on the uh, digital uh, inflators. Right, happy day. That is the mini compressor. Oh, oh. <laughs> I didn't know you were videoing. <laughs> Okay, so we're just, you can edit all that out. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're just checking the back tyre pressure now, and we can see that the back tyre pressure is way down. Yeah. It's down to nearly one bar. This is well under inflated. Um, I blame the driver for not doing his daily checks. However, here mm -hmm. we go. This, this one, mate, should be because it was a, a new wheel. <coughs> so that's pressure plus that one. Now. On some models of these, you can actually get a button on the front or on the side and you press it and it'll actually allow air out of the tyre yeah. if you put too much in, but this one hasn't got that function, so well, what is it? a little bit over pressure on this one, at, um, probably sitting at 36, so, so nah. we know it's slightly under, so it's probably about 34 psi, not the right home, about a couple of psi over. I um, mean, well, the estimated 29, but... Mm. So slightly high. Slightly high. You want to check that front one while we're here? Yeah, you might as well. Not much, do you? It's more. It's more front. <coughs> yeah, spot on that. 
Şöyle. Şöyle bir de bunu devreye yer. Sonra yine dijital olan artık onu gel de exactly spot on. Alright. Even that one I've got it's not going to be exactly right. Mm -hmm. there, there, so. Right. so so what's your overall views on it? <laughs> um it'll do what it needs to do. It'll get you home, we'll get you to the garage. Yeah, but right. I wouldn't rely on it for the exact pressures, but it'll certainly blow the tire up. Yeah, happy days. Thank you then. Dilly dilly. Dilly dilly. <laughs> <laughs>